So how to earn money in a no code world? I believe that this is a question that most of you are, you know, uh, thinking about, and, and this is uh, regardless of the level of your passion towards zero code, uh, no doubt that this crosses everyone's mind, meaning that people are, um, uh, are really um, excited about uh, what you can do with zero code, but they're even more excited about what value they can bring, what value they can get in return. And basically, uh, 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 if you do something, but you don't get money for it, it's not a business that's a hobby at most uh, or, or, or a passion uh, at worst. Uh, so uh, where do you actually, how do you monetize your no coding? So we, of course, ask the same, very same question. The discovery of the possibilities of no code tools was um, immense for us. So we realized that there's a lot of things we can do, but then we were a little lost on, on okay, but what do we do do? Meaning there's like a million different things you can do with no code. And I bet that a lot of you are asking the same questions, wondering where do you get started? And um, so we have done the dirty work for you. <laughs> We've done the work for you and we figured out that without uh, this is something that it worked for us. Uh, and by the way, a disclaimer. So uh, the lessons that I'm sharing are lessons that we have found and we have lived through and uh, and, and figured out. But for uh, for those of you who are starting from different places or are having a different backgrounds, they may or may not work exactly the same way they did for us. But I'm I'm betting that for most of you uh, who are probably just getting started, um, I'm sure that uh, a lot of them, if not all of them, will be very valuable. So where do you earn money in a no-code world? So um, there's really three different ways which are all interconnected of how you can actually learn money in no-code world. Uh, they are the no-code education, their no-code products, and custom development. What are each of those? So, uh, but to to get to uh, the discussion of all of these three and explain why they're so interconnected and there's there's zero go in the middle, let me tell you a bit about our own background and how we actually started and how did we come to this so when we started zero code we were actually doing no code consulting which is kind of an education but we were basically selling our time uh coaching other people how to do no code and which was great so we were you know there's there's a saying that there's no better way of learning something than teaching it so this was a great beginning for for us uh, you know having to explore certain topics that we may not have necessarily stumbled upon ourselves but we had to kind of go through them to uh, find out the solution for other people which are paying, which were paying us money for that. So, and that was great and fine. So we were getting started very early on. Uh, you know, nowadays, uh, no code is in a totally different place, place from where it was like five, six years ago. Uh, there's a lot less skepticism and a lot more people are exposed to it. So this uh, no code consulting will actually be probably the easiest way to for you to get started to monetize it in some way. Uh, so set our hourly rates, uh, start from something um, humble in the beginning, learn your way through it, earn your reputation, and in no time you will have uh, you know, more orders that you can uh, than you can um, process, actually. And where to look for those, I will share in my next step. Uh, but b before we get into that, uh, let me uh, tell you a bit more about our discovery. So we were kind of in the no-code education um, uh, sector right here but not quite because uh, we were selling our time and that's uh, for us this was not something that was very scalable so uh, meaning that we can only charge so much money for people that are just getting started right and we can only we only have 24 hours in a day so there's always a cap of what you can learn by consulting great way to get started fantastic way to train and hone your skills but for us we found that to be somewhat limiting to the uh, um the upside of what we can earn with the um, no code. So um, very quickly, we actually transitioned to custom development sector, uh, meaning that we were not really doing much consulting, but instead we were doing projects for people, turnkey projects, meaning that when a person was coming to us and saying, hey, um, and this is actually something that may very well come naturally, meaning some people may initially come to you and saying, hey, um, I need help in, in doing this. And uh, you may coach them, you may explain it to them. But in the end, a lot of these people will actually propose you to do it for them. So let's say, just tell me how much uh, you will need, um, how much time you will need. And I'm, I'm happy to pay that to you so you can do it for me in two hours, for example, instead of you coaching me for 20 hours. Um, that, that there'll be a lot of those uh, cases. And this, uh, this, this is what has happened to us. And we kind of 
um, segued directly from the education to custom development, but that's very much interconnected. So a lot of our customers in custom development actually came from no-code education. Uh, so uh, we started doing that and we recommend that for all of you too, because there's a lot of demand on the market. There's a lot of people that are wondering if they can do things faster and cheaper than hiring, looking for and working with traditional developers. And this is where the no-code shines, at least uh, the, the platform that we choose to start with, the bubble platform. It is an amazing, ubiquitous, universal platform that can build pretty much anything. Um, and, and this is, you know, this is its forte and this is what we explored to the most uh, when we were um, just getting started. So we, we started slowly to look for customers, to, to find customers, to pitch it to customers. There has been a lot of discoveries there and I'm going to be sharing them in the second part of my uh, pitch where I'll be telling where exactly to yes, look for customers and where not to look for customers. There's our, uh, both are very important. And I'm not sure which one is more important than that, but we have explored both of these for you. So custom development is another uh, topic that can earn very good cash. So uh, for you early on and later on as well. So we're still doing that. We're still um, doing uh, interesting projects and that's great in a lot of ways. That builds your portfolio, that builds your skill, that builds your trust with the clients. You kind of create your own name with actions, not only with words when you do some great things uh, with no code uh, tool of your choice and uh, Sooner, uh, yeah, before you know it, uh, people in the community know you. Uh, if people are happy with your services, they're referring them to you. And uh, that kind of goes very well with no-code education. But the third uh, circle about no-code products is something that we slided on uh, to pretty, uh, pretty early on as well. So we wanted to scale. We wanted something that would run and, um, and basically to not be directly tied to our time. Um, both with no code consulting and no code custom development uh, it was always limited to amount of people to amount of hours and the hourly rate that we could charge uh, with the no code products it's pretty much uh, available and it's pretty much scalable much further and it depends on the amount of people that you attract the amount of value you deliver that equals to price and uh, basically if a million people buy your one dollar product don't do that but just for the sake of the simplicity, don't sell $1 products. Uh, but let's say it's a $1 products and you have your own first million dollars. And uh, but uh, yeah, don't don't go with $1 products, please. Uh, um, so this is what we thought. And uh, we have actually created the the product that uh, didn't yet exist on the specifically on bubble um, uh, ecosystem. We have created no code templates. We were very passionate about it. Uh, the, the creators of the platform were not so passionate about it in the beginning. So we had to pitch to them. We had to prove them. We had to show them that, okay, that's, that actually has potential and people are actually interested in buying that. So uh, we were kind of doing the MVP within the, the MVP platform, if you, if you, if you will. Uh, and after we have actually shown them, there is genuine interest from, from people in the uh, no -code bubble community to bubble templates. Uh, that actually worked. Right now, Bubble Templates uh, is a large growing marketplace. And, and I believe that there's like around 100 agencies right now, which are offering both custom development services. And a lot of them, if not most of them, are actually also developing no code products, kind of following our tracks. And uh, you might be one of those agencies that are both doing development and are also developing templates uh, or plugins. So uh, that worked. Uh, and that's, uh, it's it has, uh, a steeper curve uh, or a longer curve, if you will, uh, meaning with custom development or consulting, you can uh, cash in pretty fast. So you, you basically sell an hour, get money immediately. With products, it's not that straightforward most of the time, meaning you get a product out there, you put a lot of work in it, and then it may flop. It may not sell all that well in the beginning, but in the long run, this is actually something that uh, you won't want to be because this is something that works while you sleep and 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 sells uh, you know regardless of whether you're actively working or not working at all so um this is where probably uh most of you would want to be but to get there you would probably have to step through the education and custom development part and the part of it and why they're all interconnected is that all of these businesses and all of these sides of a business are actually powering one another so a person comes in with an initial interest in education and he might get a template, which is no code product. And then he might tinker with it. And then he might get a custom development package, which is something that you're selling to them and on the north. And then he might be interested in another no code product. And then he may buy it from you as well. And then you may educate him and sell him some more um, custom development. Basically, uh, th those three branches of business are 
self-sustaining on their own, but they're also empowering one another, kind of making it all better together. So uh, this is what we um, we found out for ourselves. This is what has been working for us pretty pretty well. And this is what we believe that more people should explore and try out. Um, yeah. So this is kind of where you earn money. And besides that, of course, there are more ways to earn money that are maybe related to this one or, or, or maybe not completely unrelated to this one. For example, a lot of you may have ideas for your own products that kind of falls into no-code products category. Uh, but our products are basically serving the no-code users or no-code builders. You might build a product that serves completely, you know, everyone or people completely outside of this ecosystem. That's fine too. Uh, but there will be like one discovery that we found, uh, and at least um, uh, for us, there's basically an asterisk here, uh, a disclaimer that I'm, 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 I'll explore in a second. But um, you should try all of that. Find something that works for you and try to enhance it with as much additional auxiliary businesses as as you can. And uh, basically, that's uh, that's our recipe.